Hey, this is Dennis. It's uh, Tuesday morning. I want to get back in the Bible study. We're in the book of Mark, chapter 10. We're going to start with verse 32. And they were in the way going up to Jerusalem. And Jesus went before them, and they were amazed as they followed and they were afraid. I can just think, you know, they were like, oh, Lord, we're going to Jerusalem. Where those religious hypocrites have been after us and hounding us and dogging us out. And they were afraid. And he took again the twelve and began to tell them what things should happen unto him, saying, Behold, we go up to Jerusalem, and the Son of Man, Jesus talking about himself, shall be delivered unto the chief priests and unto the scribes, the religious people, and they shall condemn him to death and shall deliver him to the Gentiles, and they shall mock him and shall scourge him, meaning they're going to beat him up and whip on him, and shall spit upon him and shall kill him, in the third day he shall rise again. And James and John, the sons of Zebedee, came unto him, saying, Master, we would that thou shouldest do for us whatsoever she, we will shall ask. So they're like, Jesus, we, we want to ask you something, and, and we want you to, to do it for us. And he said unto them, What would ye that I should do for you? What do you want me to do for you? They said unto him, Grant unto us that we may set one on the right hand and the other on the left hand in thy glory. To me, talking about the kingdom of God. But Jesus said unto them, You know not what you ask. Can you drink of the cup I drink of and be baptized with the baptized, baptism that I am baptized with? And they said unto him, We can. And Jesus said unto them, You shall indeed drink of the cup that I drink of, and with the baptized, baptism that I am baptized. You're going to be baptized with that also. But to sit on my right hand and on my left hand is not mine to give. And I want y'all to think about that a minute. Jesus was talking to them, James and John, and he said, to say that you can sit on my right hand or my left hand is not mine to give. Well, if he can't give it, who can? God the Father. That shows you right there the difference, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Jesus, right here, he's saying, I don't have the authority to say that you can sit at my left and right hand. So to me, it's, he's saying, God the Father got that figured out. But it shall be given to them for whom it is prepared. God the Father is going to prepare all that. And when the ten heard it, they began to be much displeased with James and John. But Jesus called them to him and said to them, You know that they which are accounted to rule over the Gentiles exercise lordship over them. And their great ones exercise authority over them. But it shall not be that way among you. But whosoever will be great among you shall be your minister, and whosoever of you will be the chiefest shall be the servant of all. In verse 45 here, I think Jesus is relating to his, his way. Listen to verse 45. For even the Son of Man came not to be ministered unto, but to minister. Jesus came not that other people would be ministering to him. Jesus came to minister 
to everybody else and to give his life a ransom for many. Well, right there, Jesus acknowledging that he's given his life for our ransom. For all those that believe upon Jesus Christ and call upon him shall be saved. There's only one way, one way to get in the kingdom of God, and that's Jesus Christ. God bless y'all. Walk with God one day at a time. Bye-bye.